Today's video is sponsored by Mystery Retros. If you haven't already, make sure you check them out in the link down below. You can get 10% off with Pingu as the discount code. Of course, you can get retro shirts, such as this Atletico Madrid, which is very nice and clean. Or you can get a current kit, such as the IX third kit. Hello and welcome to Guess the Football, the new football quiz series in which you guys are looking for the connection between the five clubs that the play players have played for. There's five players and uh, the contestant for today to finish off the hat-trick of red-haired uh, fever <laughs> content craze is Jack54. I'm the best one. Um, how are you doing? Yeah, save the best till last. <laughs> I've, I've built up. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing very well. Um, I'm excited, mate. Very excited for this. I, li I like the new concept as well. Um... I'm worried about how I may do though, because in all these series that you've created, I started off pretty well. Maybe because Oakley was my opponent. Um, yeah. That's a little dig there, if you didn't realise. Um, but then last time I did an episode, it was against Curbs, and I got absolutely wiped out. So obviously that wasn't this series, yeah. but still, it's like football, like knowledge y kind of thing, do you know what I mean? So, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Hopefully I do well. Yeah, quite. Right. We'll see how you do. Um, we can put you in the hot seat first, see how, see how you do with this one. Um, the first club I'm going to give you, Jack, is going to be a bit of West Bromwich Albion. West You're all the Bromwich time is what you Albion. Just take your time and think it through. Ben Foster. It's not the cycling goalkeeper. I like it, though. Um, the next club I'm going to give you is Everton. Ooh. West Brom and Everton. Oh, this is where I'm going to be like thinking about players and I can't actually say their name because I don't know what they're called. There's so many. Yeah. West Brom and Everton. Oh, things I can like see players. It's doing my head in. Um, oh, I'm just going to... I don't think he played for Everton, but... He might not have even played for West Brom, but Peter Oden Wingy. <laughs> Neither of them. <laughs> Peter Oden Wingy. He did play for West Brom at least. Did he? Um, he did play for a lot of clubs, to be fair. I like that. Um, the next club is Manchester United. Ah. Uh, oh my god. Uh, West Brom, Everton, Man United. Gibson. It's not Gibson. I like I like it. He has played for both Everton and United. I don't know if he went to West Brom. I can't remember what he did after Everton. West he did go to one of those kind of teams though West in the Midlands. The yeah. thing is like um, West Brom haven't been in the Premier League next... for a couple of years, so it's like Yeah, trying knowledge. to remember who they are. Trying to remember the back past. in the day. Mm hmm The next club is Chelsea. Oh fuck this is where I should be getting it. I'm I'm not gonna be able to get this. Chelsea, Man United, Everton, West Brom. Chelsea, Chelsea, Man United, Everton, West Brom. Um, <clears throat> it's gonna be really not. I mean, it's gonna be really obvious, I know it is. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to just take a guess, Jack, and then I can kind of give you um, the final club to take out the misery. I don't have a guess, mate. You can you can say any any Chelsea or Man United links. Anyone that's played for both of those Mate, I'm two. thinking about so many things right now. <laughs> I can't even think of a Chelsea and United. <laughs> yeah, you're trying to focus on <laughs> those two. West Brom's done me. That's what's yeah. done me. Yeah. Anyone? Got Tim Howard, any even though he's just played for Everton. T Tim Howard. <laughs> it's not Tim Howard. He has played for Man United as well, to be fair. So at least you ticked off two. Okay. Uh, the final club, his current club, Jack, is Inter Milan. Oh that confused you even more. I'm gonna go for. I'm gonna be really annoyed. I know. Inter Milan. He's at Inter. But he's and currently he's at Inter. For... Yep, and he's played for Chelsea, Man United, Everton, and West Brom. You think of any Inter Milan FIFA cards? Borja Valero, but it's not that. I mean, that he used to play for Inter. He's probably retired now. I played for Chelsea or Man United, though. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I, I actually don't have a guess, mate. I'm sorry. Biabiani. It's not Bibiani. <laughs> um, do, do I'm going to kick myself. <laughs> I'll give you a clue. It's um, one of Curbs' favourite walkouts, if you know that. 
Oh my god. Lukaku. It's Lukaku. <laughs> I think people like are gonna be uh, a little bit disappointed with that, especially with the Inter Milan. I kind of understand oh, it with mate. the yeah, but I'm just stupid. Yeah, that's just absolutely stupid. Absolutely stupid. Oh, it's the morning. That's so annoying. It's the morning. That, that's so annoying. Right, I'm, look, first round out of the way, ladies and gentlemen. Don't yeah, judge yeah. me too early on Warm this, up. please. All right, mate, first club I'm going to say is Toulouse. Toulouse. Ooh. Am I going to lose a lot of points here? Um, <laughs> it's a bit of a savage one, to be fair, but... <laughs> to lose. You see, I'm going to go Ben Yedder. Ooh, it's a good, it's a good shout, mate, but no. Yeah, no. Um, second club, I will say... PSG. To lose and PSG. Got to be French then, surely. Because no, there's nobody, like, not... Going to Toulouse that are French. Um, is it Toulalan? No, that's a that's a good shout as well. Does he still yeah. play? I don't think so. He's about forty, I think. To be <laughs> Probably have a hero card next year or something like that. Yeah, thirty nine. Um, all right. The next club is Villarreal. Villarreal. PSG. I like it. He's, he's moving around. Um, I feel like I can get it off these three. That's why I'm taking my time. Just yeah. want to get the points early. Um, PSG and Villarreal. I'm going to say Cap de Villa. It's not, mate. Um, the fourth club is Nottingham Forest. Wait. Oh, it's um, it's what it's what electricity does. It surges, doesn't it, Jack? <laughs> so <Surge Oreo. laughs> Well done, mate. Well done. I, I was like going to say Spurs is the fourth one, but I thought yeah. that's definitely less bait than Nor Nottingham Forest because I think a lot of people do think about Oreo and Spur and Spurs mm, being more yeah, than yeah. Forest right now. Do you know what I mean? Even though he's played for them, but I thought yeah, yeah. So well done, mate. He's played the most games for him, so it makes sense. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I like that. So I get two, uh, two points for that. <coughs> two points on the board, little mate. Two-nil lead already for me. <laughs> A little surge uh, into my uh, first club then of this uh, player. I'm going to go for a bit of Word of Bremen. Word of Bremen. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say. So Werder Bremen, I'm, I was just thinking about, I was getting that mixed up with Wolfsburg in my head, thinking about the round badge, but Werder Bremen's actually more like the diamond badge, isn't it? Or yeah, like the that. diamond green one. Yeah. The diamond badge, I can see a lot of players here in my head. Um, uh, I was going to say Wolfsburg, but no. I can't remember whether he actually played for them or Wolfsburg, or maybe even either, but I'm just going to go for a bit of a punt with Andre Schürrle. I don't think he did. It's not the player anyway, um, but I don't think he, he He went to a lot of Bundesliga teams, so it's a good shout. Um, the next club is 1899 Hoffenheim. I don't know if the 1899 is really necessary, but you know the one with the the, the old Firmino club. Yeah, 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 yeah. Funny enough, I was actually going to say Firmino, even though I don't think he's actually <laughs> There's your clue. But... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um... It's really annoying because I can like see players. Oh. Mm, you're just trying to remember old FIFA cards that have moved between the two clubs and like. Yeah. Um, can I hear the next club, please? You know, you're gonna just throw out a Bundesliga name. Any anyone? Go on. Anyone that could, first first Bundesliga player that comes to your mind. Goretzka. It's not Goretzka. The next club is actually Bayern Munich as well. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, no. Um, <clears throat> Wolfsburg. Yeah, Werder Bremen. 
Not Wolfsburg. Oh, no, yes, sorry, Werderbremen. Uh, <laughs> Get the right club. Werderbremen, Hoffenheim, <laughs> and Bayern Munich. I know I'm going to kick myself again. I know it. I don't know. At this point, I'll, I'll let you off. But I think you might get it on the last two. Müller's been at Bayern for absolute donkeys. I'm just going to go Kimmich. It's not Kimmich. It's not a bad shout, actually, because he has played for, I think, a couple of others. on. I think it was Stuttgart and... I can't remember. But I know he's been about a bit. Um, the next club is West Bromwich Albion. Oh, for crying out loud. Is These that West Brom links, bro. No, not in the slightest. <laughs> West Brom West is just like Brom. the bogey club. West Brom by Munich, Hoffenheim and Word of Bremen. This is a poor display from me. West Brom, why? <sighs> My West Brom ball knowledge is not up to point, that's for sure. I'm going to say Nabry. Serge Gnabry? Yeah. That is the correct connection. Well done, Jack. Thank God for that. Jesus Christ, that took long <laughs> enough. Oh, my word. Last club was going to be Arsenal. Um, yeah, I kind of went yeah. in a... Do you know what? That came to me by pure luck, to be honest with you, mate. Yeah. Did you just think of the Tony Pulis not playing him because he wasn't good <laughs> yeah. enough? Exactly. Yeah. At West Brom. Do you know yeah. what? It, I think it's important for me in this series not to focus so much on the first and second clubs. Yeah, I feel they're, like that they're, really does me in. They're the niche ones that you're not probably Yeah, I just get need to kind on. of forget about them because I was thinking, yeah. my brain was trying to do flips over like, yeah, just yeah, clubs you only which played like I have 20 odd games not to... much knowledge about. Yeah. It's all right, you're on level level scores with me now. Lovely stuff. My turn to uh, see how I do. Yes, so, all right. Um, first club, I'm going to say... Uh, Sao Paulo. Sao Paulo is a first and a niche club. Well, it could be an obvious one, to be fair. You could just get rid of the opposite. <laughs> um, double bluff me. Um, someone who's played for Sao Paulo. I'm just going to say Richarlison. I don't think he has, but... No. Played for a lot of clubs. Um, second club, I will say... Villarreal. Okay. You like your Villarreal's, don't you? <laughs> I know. You like your West Broms, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I realise this is what we both used players with the name Serge back to back. Yeah. <laughs> Serge Aurier and Serge Gnabry. Um, <laughs> surging through this. Um, Villarreal and Sao Paulo. Is it. Um, no, because why would you... I'm going to say Nilmar, but I don't think it is Nilmar. It's not, mate. No, nah, I was just it's thinking not. of a real Brazilian. Yeah, no, no, no. What a card, by the way. If anyone remembers yeah. that card on FIFA. Unbelievable. Bring it back. <laughs> uh, I'm going to then say... I feel like you've got someone with, like, 20 clubs and you're just cherry-picking them. <laughs> Chelsea. Chelsea next. Chelsea and Villarreal. Did he go there? I think he did that. Is it Alexander Pato? Well done, mate. Is yes, it the duck? He's the duck. He played two games. <laughs> two games why... and scored one yeah. goal. That the only reason I got that. That's the best greatest in the Premier League. Yeah. I did a FIFA Connect with, well, recently basically with Pato as a Chelsea connection. Ah, I see. And I just yeah. I remember looking through. Basically, I was just thinking of Brazilians at Villarreal. And he it was either up, that so. or like saying Orlando City next, but I think yeah. you probably you just would have got that straight away. Maybe Kaka. Okay. Kaka played for yeah. Orlando City. Yeah, that's what I could have got. But as then well he didn't play that. for Villarreal. No. So, not that I know of anyway. Right, it's your turn. Um, first club I'm going to give you is Real Madrid. Real Madrid. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, good start. Um, Let's go for James Rodriguez. It's not James Rodriguez. Next club is Getafe. Getafe? Do you know what I really want to say? And I don't know his name, but he also played for like Chelsea. It's that Brazilian guy. I don't know if he actually played for Real Madrid though. 
Ramirez? Nah. I don't you try to think of. He also plays for like Everton on loan. He like went on loan everywhere from Chelsea. He's like a left midfielder. Kennedy. Low rated. Pardon? Kennedy is the one That's you think it, of. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is that your guess? Um, pardon? Is that going to be your guess? No, it's not going to be my no. guess. Uh, I'm going to say a bit of a random one. Don't actually know if he played for Getafe, but if he's played for Getafe and then gone to Real Madrid, or I mean, I'm assuming, don't get me wrong here, could be completely wrong. He might have played in La Liga from like youth or whatever, so he might have gone for the ranks. Likelihood is he could be Spanish, so I'm just going to I'm going to throw it out there randomly and say Isco. It's not Isco. Actually, that's a bit of a crap one because he probably hasn't played for more than five clubs. He actually had a deadline day deal uh, collapse because the way they do the wages in Germany differently to Spain. So they do it like pre-tax in Germany oh, and post-tax in Spain. So he thought he was getting more money, but when he turned up, it's actually half the money because obviously he's got to give the other half to, t- to the tax man. So he, <laughs> oh, he, he went, no, I'm not joining. <laughs> I don't blame him. Yeah. <laughs> he was going to go to Union Berlin, to be fair. So, you ah. know, maybe he wants to stay in Spain. Um, yeah. The next club is Valencia, the Spanish club. Valencia? I'm going to go for a bit of a bold one. Uh, <laughs> did he even play for Valencia before? Xabi Alonso? It's not Xabi Alonso. Next club, <laughs> bit of a curveball, Queen's Park Rangers. QPR? Oh my god. Oh, for crying out loud. It's a bit of a, a, bit of a memory test, this is, because they haven't been in the Prem for a while. Yeah, I'm just thinking back to like when they had like Adele Tarapt Tarap- and stuff. Junior Hoylet was maybe there, I don't know. It was when they like signed quite, a f- probably around the era when they signed a few weird players, didn't they? Oh goodness me, that's actually thrown me off way more than I probably wanted it to. <laughs> that's, I was uh, debating where to put QPR because it's like it's either you know yeah, it or I'm you not don't. Yeah, like, any club player. that is no longer in the prem. Yeah, I probably will not help me. I actually think it probably throws me off <laughs> even more. I'm just thinking Spanish players, to be honest, that have played for QPR. And I can see the cards, I just can't say the names. It's going to be an absolute wild guess. And it. Oh no, it's probably tight. No. I'm coming out of some mental names here, but I'm going to go <laughs> for. Go on, the Spanish footballer. Arbeloa. <laughs> I like it. It's not right. <laughs> Just say Liverpool next, please. <laughs> no, the final club is Villa Real. So you got Valencia, oh. Villa Real, Getafe, God. Real Madrid, and QPR. Yeah. I'm to finished. be fair, before before I said QPR, I don't think many people get it from Madrid, Getafe, Valencia. Maybe Valencia. But the QPR and the Villarreal are probably your best bets. But you probably can't remember all QPR players. No, QPR is fully... Like, this could be any Spanish player to me. Um, Asenjo. Asenjo is not the uh, player. (laughs) He is a walkout in FIFA 23. He's Spanish. He's a midfielder. Parejo. It's Danny Parejo. Played for he QPR. played for QPR? Yeah, in 2008. Jesus. <laughs> yeah. Fair play. The other the other one that some people might have thought is Esteban Guerrero. He also played for QPR from Real Madrid, ah, Getafe as well. I had absolutely no idea that Parejo yeah. played for QPR. That's, it's one of those like little bits of like... Like you'll see a TikTok you of know like, it, random transfers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you know it, it's like light bulb moment. You've yeah, yeah. It. Yeah. Jesus. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I thought, I thought throw him in there with a funny old career. <laughs> um, all right. I will say first club. 
Juventus. Juventus as a niche-ish club. Uh, Nicholas Anelka. <laughs> it's a bit of no. a meta, meta one in this series. <laughs> um, I'll then say Benfica. Okay, Benfica. I'm actually doing a Benfica save on football manager at the minute. So I'm just trying to think of any like players because they always like have little comments like X player says so and so. Is played. Ooh. Jao Kinsella. Oh my god. Fair play. Fair I, I, play. My mind, my mind he played went. one professional game for Benfica. <laughs> I just went Portuguese Juve players. That's kind of and I knew it wasn't Ronaldo, so. I maybe There's, should have gone like into Milan or something. Yeah, I think a bit less. He, he went Valencia as well, didn't he? I do he know Cancelo's career quite well to be fair. I think I know all of them. Jesus. Fair play, yeah, mate. Yeah, all, all of those clubs are out the way. I think it would have been yeah. nice though to go City by and la ending, to be fair. Yes. The first club is Sambioni Fasakeski. It's in, it's in Siri, Siri D. That's a little Siri clue for D. It. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Just, just, just name anyone and move on. Uh, okay, any, any Italian. Balotelli. It's not Balotelli. I was tempted to do it as well. <laughs> the next one is Hellas Verona. Actually, actually know that club for once. Hellas Verona? Crikey. I know the badge is like... The blue. Red and like blue. Yeah. I think they changed I think. it recently, to be fair. Ah. I swear it used to be like a shield split down the middle. It's just a oh, blue I, I, badge now. But I know it was ah, different in the past. Yeah. I'm pretty sure they had yellow in it as well. Uh-huh. Um, I mean, I've just got to go for probably someone just random. So just I will Italian. say... Quagliarella. I like it. I was actually going to do it as well. It's not Quagliarella. <laughs> Next club is Napoli. Napoli, okay. Yeah. Top of Serie A at the minute. Jorginho? It is actually Jorginho for three points. Hold on, Jack. Hey, there we go. Nice one. I guess you on to five at least. Um, next club <laughs> would have been Chelsea, and then Arsenal, Arsenal. who's just moved yeah. to. So it would be a bit cheeky to do a recent transfer. <clears throat> um, mm -hmm. Yeah, decent to get that on that. Napoli, to be fair. I see. I assume you're just yeah. thinking of like ex Napoli players from a couple of years ago. Yeah, um, I, I couldn't really think of many. I mean, English Italian one. I mean, English Italian ones. <laughs> Italian. There's not. Well, there's a few Napoli English. Um, why am I? Why do I keep saying English? Italian Napoli, Napoli players. players. Yeah. But they're like, I don't know. Not that. It's like Politano and stuff. There's not. Really yeah, anything. and like Di yeah. Lorenzo and stuff. They just you just kind of disregard them straight away. Yeah. Because they probably haven't played for five clubs. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, All right, okay. well, happy Makes it days interesting. then. Um, yeah, first club, Vasco da Gama. Vasco da Gama. I'm pretty sure he was a person as well. Um, <laughs> that's in the Portuguese league, I'm pretty sure. Vasco da Gama. Mm -hmm. oh, do you know what? I think I know who it is as well. I remember seeing someone starting their career in Vasco. I don't know why I have this information. Um, Vasco da Gama. I'm just going to say Diego Costa. No. No. I will then say... Alwada. Quaresma? No. Do you know, I think he's played for Vasco together as well. <laughs> um, third club is Udinese. Udinese. Alexis Sanchez? No. No. Fourth club is Napoli. Napoli and Udinese. El Ward has thrown me off. 
trying to think of people that have gone to the Saudi League, I think. I don't know where they are. Maybe the Qatari. Mm -hmm. um, Gabbiadini. Nope. Nope. And the final club is Everton. Everton. Oh, Alan. Yeah. Well done, mate. <laughs> I knew it. I probably, yeah. Well done. I probably would have got that from. Why did I know? Yeah, Alwada. Because he's there now, mm -hmm. isn't he? I think yes. that was, yeah. Probably the best way to do it, to be fair. Mm -hmm. That order. Yeah, why, why do I know Vasco? I think it was Charisma's. There's probably there's quite card. a few. I think uh, like Ronaldinho used to play for them, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I remember I being, I'm... yeah, a lot of like. Diego Costa might have started there as well. Although, was that, or that was that, was that Cruzario? I remember they used to be full of talent. Hmm. Yeah. Who knows? Let us know, guys, in the comments. Um, into the final round, then, is the icon slash hero. So you kind of can work out a bit easier that it's going to be an icon or hero. So your guesses yeah. are a bit more concise. So a few more points up for grabs. Um, first call I'm going to give you, Jack, is Wolverhampton Wanderers. Wolverhampton Wanderers. Crikey. For an icon or hero. Jesus. Icon or hero. Wolver bloody Hampton Wanderers. I don't know why, I'm either thinking Barnes or Peter Crouch. <laughs> Um, Actually, he's not a bad one because he covers a, a lot of clubs. He covers a lot of clubs, doesn't he? Yeah. Mm. Barnes. Would I be Would I be mean to use John Barnes with you? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody that you never actually watch play live. Yeah. Yeah. True. <laughs> uh, I'll just I'll just say Peter Crouch. It's not Peter Crouch. Um, the next club I'm going to give you is. Inter Milan. Ooh. Okay. Wolves and Inter Milan. From from the Midlands to Milan. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Inter Wolves. It's far. Oh. It's like that QPR throw off. Yeah, it's yeah, it's really done, mate. Your mind's like, just not really putting them together. Yeah, I'd... just any any icon or hero. Yeah, I can't I can't think of a uh, player that played for Wolves, but I'll just chuck out an into one and hope they randomly played for Wolverhampton at some stage in their career. I will go for. I, just, I know he hasn't, and did he even play for Inter? I'm pretty sure he did. Vidic. <laughs> Vidic is not the uh, correct player. Yeah. But he did play for Inter, to be fair. Yeah. He's got one. Um, the next club is going to be Liverpool. Interesting. I'm going to go for a bit of a random one here. Is it Litmanen? It's not Yori Lippmann. I think he did play for Inter and Liverpool, though, to be fair. Um, yeah. The next club... Wolves, man. ...is... I can go one or two ways here. I think I'll go... LA Galaxy next. Liverpool and LA Galaxy? Gerard. <laughs> um, doesn't, doesn't qualify for this series. <laughs> With his whole two club CV. <laughs> um, oh, by the way, guys, I definitely didn't think Gerard played for Wolves. By the way, <laughs> just, just leave the players that actually, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, just trying to think about the Liverpool and LA Galaxy link. To be honest with mm. you, it's going to be a bold one, but I will say 
I don't think he even played for LA Galaxy, but Harry Kuehl. Not Harry Kuehl. The final club, the most known, is Tottenham Hotspur. Tottenham Hotspur? Tottenham, Liverpool and LA Galaxy. It's probably the three that will get it for you. I'm going to kick myself, I know I am. You will. Oh no. Oh, unless it was... He played for Inter Milan as well. <laughs> Again, it's another one where it's like a light bulb moment with the Inter Milan. But if you don't know it, then just focus on Tottenham, Liverpool and Galaxy. Who ended their career in the MLS? I know that this is the thing. That's this is what I'm thinking of. Yeah. I'm gonna. I thing is, I can't even think about like heroes right now or flipping icons. I'll tell you, his middle name's David. It's not gonna help you. At all. <laughs> just, <laughs> just look at his Wikipedia page. <laughs> He's never been referred to as David. <laughs> I guess it rules out it's not his first name. It's not going to be called David David, is he? Yeah. It's not uh, David Beckham. <laughs> I want you to get this, Jack. Just for your sanity. Oh my, honestly, I'm going to cry. The reason I'm doing this round as well is because you can actually look at their icon profile. So when you look at the card, you can see all these clubs on it. Oh, uh, I see. So all, all the answers are there for you. Oh, fuck. <laughs> so every time you do the score building series, <laughs> you put this guy yes. in. <laughs> There's all them clubs. <laughs> oh, yeah, no. No pressure, but if you get this right, you do actually beat Angry Ginger's score. Oh, do I actually? Yeah, yeah. So you become like... I can't remember what Tom got. The top, Did Tom yeah. get worse? Uh, no, I think you'll be the second. You'll be the second best out of the three. Tom got nine. Ginger got five. You're on five at the minute. You need you need this point. I was going to think of Ledley King, but then he's definitely not played for Inter. Not that I know of, anyway. Has he, he played for Liverpool? No. <laughs> definitely not. Yeah, I'm just going to go for Cole. He definitely is not Joe Cole. but so yeah. It's not Joe Cole. The first thing you'll Tell me for, the first name of him. I think you'll get it on his first name. Uh, he's a striker. He's also played for Leeds, Celtic, West Ham, Aston Villa, and even Coventry, actually. Jesus Christ. So there's a lot of clubs. Um, I think. His name begins with a K. He's actually got the initials of another uh, of an icon. Oh, oh no. Oh no. It's oh, Robbie Robbie King no. Jack. Yeah. Do you know what? Yeah, I was thinking there was I was looking I was thinking about heroes especially and I was thinking all I could think about was Tim Cahill. I couldn't get Robbie Keane into my head if I mm. love no money. Yep. The Inter Milan, he went to yeah, Inter yeah. Milan. Six games for them at the start of his career. Oh, right, right, yeah. 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 Well, he, Jesus! He, he did. He did really well at Wolves and Coventry, and then went, went to Inter Milan. Fair play. First club, mate, is going to be Shanghai. Just Shanghai. Yeah. Is there a is there a Shen Hua at the end? Uh, probably. It's Shanghai S I P G. Shanghai S I. Oh, it's that one. Right. I don't think that is Shen Hua. Um, gonna assume that it could be Didier Drogba. No. <laughs> <laughs> really, really uh, the that. next club is gonna be Porto. Porto. Deco. Who? Sorry. Deco. No. The next club is going to be Monaco. 
bit of a... Uh... Hmm. There's not many, like, known Monaco players. That's the thing. Mm-hmm. Usually players come out of Monaco and then... Go elsewhere, I suppose. The thing is, I was going to say Falcao, but he's not a hero or icon card at any point. <laughs> mm -hmm. But he's played for... I don't think he went to, I don't know if he did go to the Chinese League. I'm trying to think of some of the new heroes. There could be an icon, there's so many. Um, Monica. I'm just going to say Petit. It is Petit. No, it is not. That would have been a small The next w. club, I will say, is Real Madrid. Real Madrid and Monaco. Yeah, it's the Hamas Rodriguez route. He's gone Porto, Monaco, Real Madrid. <laughs> Got Everton next. Um, <laughs> who's been there? You kind of go a bit blank when you're trying to think. You like, yeah, that's the thing. Going, what's... Uh, Luis Figo. It is not. And the final club is Chelsea. Chelsea last. So you've got Chelsea, Real Madrid, Monaco, Shanghai, and Porto. Oh, wait, did he go to that? No, he didn't go there. Or did he? I think he did. No, Zessian Makaleli. I'm trying to think of Chelsea Real Madrid players. Don't probably a player that might or probably should have. Uh, I would say probably deserved a bit more respect, actually. The most known. I was going to say Makaleli. It's not, mate. No. I think he played it a Porto. Is, you, you might kick yourself, actually. Probably um, will. It's, it's a defender. Defender. It's Real part Madrid. of the Mourinho phase oh, of Chelsea. Oh, Car Carvalho. Yes, yeah. Do you know what the annoying thing is? I was actually going to give him for you, but I didn't look really? at his clubs before. I was looking through Heroes. I was like, yeah, Carvalho's had a few. It, he had I didn't a think... bit of a weird career. He went... So he... It started at Porto, 1996, yeah. 2004. But during that time, he went on loan like three times. Um, one to Lecca, one to Vittoria, and then one to Alversa. I'm assuming that must have been quite early on in his career. But he played like 70 games throughout that period, which probably if he's quite mm. young, it's yeah. probably uh, he must have been probably highly touted when he was fairly young. So I don't know. Actually, yeah, that was when he was 20. There. With the Monaco. Yeah, I thought the yeah. Monaco would be before Real, and that's what's going yeah. in the head. Uh -huh. um, yeah, I probably should have got that one at the end, but uh, oh well. Uh, still, five points to you, ten, ten to me. Ten, ten. Poor display from me, Somewhere. got yeah. to say. As, as Ginge says, um, just get all the ginger ones on first to make it easy. <laughs> just, to, <laughs> just to build up my confidence. Um, but yeah. Hopefully you guys did enjoy today's episode. Make sure you do check out Jack if you haven't already. Drop him a follow and we'll catch you all next time. Peace.